Hello everybody, today we're going to construct a polynomial function of least degree possible using the given information. We have real roots to be negative 1, 1, 3, and 2, f2 is the same as 2, 4. Another way of saying it, f2 is equal to 4, so when x is 2, the function is equal to 4. Now to write an equation, to write the equation of the polynomial, uh, we need the roots. So uh, you have f of x equal to a x minus c1 times x minus c2 to x minus cn, where c1, c2, c3 all the way to cn are the roots. And a is a number, non-zero number, and it's determined by the initial condition we have here. So since we have roots of negative 1, 1, and 3, that means the polynomial must have, uh, must have the following factors. So must have uh, these factors. Uh, so we have x minus negative 1 or x plus 1. That's one factor. x minus 1. And x minus 3. These are the three factors of the polynomial. Now, if you recall, if k is a 0 or simply a root, right, then x minus k is a factor of f. Okay? So this is true. So since these are. Uh, the zeros, these are the factors. So our function becomes a x minus c1, or these factors, I just wrote them down, x plus 1 times x minus 1 times x minus 3. So we need to distribute here uh, x plus 1 times x minus 1, that gives me x squared minus 1. If you recall, this is a product of the sum and difference of two numbers the same two numbers, times x minus 3. And that's equal to a, distributing here using FOIL, x squared times x, that's x cubed, x squared times negative 3, that's negative 3x squared, minus 1 times x, that's minus 1x or minus x, minus 1 times negative 3, that's plus 3. So uh, now, we need to find a. We need to find a using the initial condition. f2 is equal to 4. So when x is 2, right, that will give me a, replace x with 2, 2 cubed, minus 3 times 2 squared, minus 2 plus 3, and f of 2 is equal to 4. That means this is equal to 4. Okay? So now uh, simplifying this and solving for a, we get a equal a parentheses 2 cubed is 8 minus 2 squared is 4, 4 times 3 is 12, negative 2 plus 3, you can write it as 1, plus 1 equal to 4. Now 8 minus 12 is negative 4, negative 4 plus 1 is negative 3, so negative 3 times a, negative 3a equals to 4, and we just solve for a, divide both sides by negative 3, and a would be equal to negative 4 third. So the polynomials function that they want us to construct would become f of x equal to, so using this one right here, a, a is negative 4 third, x cubed minus 3x squared, minus x plus 3. This would be our function. You can if you want to distribute the a, but this is fine, and this is the polynomial function. I hope you find this video helpful, and uh, see you next video. Have a good night, everyone. Bye-bye.